Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Persona 4. And in the last episode, we went on the school camping trip, and it was very eventful. I suggest you go check out that episode. And yeah, we also learned a little about a little about Rize, who appeared on TV. Apparently, she's a very popular idol who's going to be moving to Inaba. And there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of discussion uh, about her. So yeah, but anyway, we are on the 20th of June, and the first thing we're gonna do this afternoon is go and get the Hermit Rank 5 request. Um, so we're obviously gonna go into town and head to the shrine. And let's accept the Emma's request. Bum, 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 bum. Fox brought you an Emma with a wish written on it. It's written on large and even letters. It's probably by a child. God, please give me some friends. <laughs> Straight to the point. Think you wish is fulfilled? Okay. Place accept. Quest 10, I wish I had friends. Dude, same. Yeah, I'm assuming the big gap in the uh, the quest list is all the fox requests. Yeah, I wish for love. I wish didn't crave snacks. We wish a dog would return. Like all of these up to uh, 17 are probably the the dog the fox quests, and then that's why the quests kind of continue from here. That would make sense. I also I'm gonna try and catch some bugs again. I'm assuming we're gonna need some more again, so yeah, let's try and get it when the exclamation mark appears. Kaboom! Yes, I got it. Oh, I got achievement unlocked, Bug Hunter. So if you want the achievement, all right, I got. Wow, I got a ton. Sweet, sweet. I'm. Sure, they will come in useful. Alright. Accept the request. Speak to the boy at the Samagawa Flood Plains. You will need a prize sticker to get which you get from ordering from the shopping channel. Give him one of your prize stickers. Oh, it must be this kid. I don't have any money. I don't want your money. You're not here for anything else then, right? I don't have any friends, so no one ever wants to talk to me. The boy seems sad. So he doesn't have any friends. Perhaps he's the one who wrote the Emma request on the fox. The, the, the fox showed you, rather. Everyone talks about things I don't know about. Right now, they're all collecting stickers. I have a sticker too, but they all said everyone has that one. If I had a rare sticker, I bet they become my friends. Mister, is that a sticker? Boy, no, this is the prize sticker. Grant of your desires. If this sticker can do that, then I'm sure to make friends. Let's give him the sticker. Thank you. I'm sure to have lots of friends now. Boy ran off cheerfully. Should ask him another time. So yeah, I'm I'm assuming we will uh, we will run into the kid again. So now the only le thing left to do is spend our time, which we're gonna do by going to school and starting a new social link, which we've spent a lot of time setting up. Oh, Lunasan, is there something you want? You recall you had borrowed a handkerchief from him. Would you return the handkerchief and talk with him? Yes. This is... Could have just thrown that away. This is my sister's handkerchief. My mum put it in my bag by mistake. No one ever uses it anymore, so... I'm sure the handkerchief is glad to have been able to fulfill its duty. Thank you. Express his gratitude. Pick any response you like. No, thank you. No, it's okay. Oh, I'm Naoki Konishi. Naoki. I apologize for saying I hated you when I first met you. I didn't mind. Thank God. I mean, I was kind of pissed, but uh, we won't talk about it. <laughs> Now Kikonishi. Struggling to cope with this complicated situation. And there we go. 
Yeah, this would have, I would have, again, would never have found this if I didn't know. The Hanged Man Arcana. I didn't even know that was, uh, that was an Arcana. <laughs> Last time when I came to that meeting, I made everyone feel uneasy, right? After that, I was officially fired from the association. They told me not to come to meetings anymore. Well, it's my own fault. Left behind again. It's okay with you. Maybe we can have fun together. I'm usually by our liquor store at the beginning of the week. Okay. I'm helping out there. Well, I'll be going. Goodbye. Parted ways from Naoki and went home. Alrighty. You're back. I'm just gonna check. I'm behind with Dojima, right? Hierophant, rank 4. I'm just scrolling down. Hierophant. Uh, yeah, I need, I'm actually uh, on the guide at the point that I'm at. Uh, it says just read a book. Uh, I am not gonna do that. <laughs> I'm gonna spend time with Dojima, I think. So let me just find... Hierophant 5, real quick, I apologize. Just want to make sure, there we go. <laughs> Asking about Nanako's mother, especially Emil, to get something out of him. I have Anzu, yep, let's spend some time with Jima. Ah. So, like, this is the thing, I'm not following the guide to a T, because I'm, you know, I've done some things differently, so I've got to be smart about when I change stuff around. She was looking for something. It was there before. Damn, damn kids. Only teach them how to file data anymore. Sorry. I wasn't talking about you. Can I help? No. It's okay. Don't worry about it. I was trying to find an old newspaper article. It was falling apart, so I made a copy, but... Copy seems to have gone missing. There's a certain case where we don't have a suspect yet. Since the trail's gone cold, it's about to be buried under newer cases. I can't give up on this one. Ever. Jima has a concerned look on his face. It doesn't seem to be the time or place to ask him more about it. Dad? What's wrong? My stomach hurts. Huh? Was it something you ate? It feels like a sharp pain below my stomach. I'll call the doc- No, wait, this happened before. Is it the same feeling? I don't know. Man. Okay, the medicine we used before is- Damn it, who's calling me at this time of night? Sojima here, what's this about? Sealed letter? For me? Is it from Ichihara-san? When did it come? You forgot? I'm on my way. Gotta go, the medicine should be in the first aid kit. She's in your hands. Sojima left. Give Nanako the medicine and put her to bed. A few hours later. <sighs> Jima has come home. He seems to be in a bad mood. Luna, you're still up? It's like, go to sleep. Are you okay? Just shut up. Wow. Sorry. Damn. Jima looks apologetic. How's Nanako? She's sleeping. Good. Thanks. You've been a great help here. Jima seems to bear a heavy burden. What is he keeping locked up in his heart? Man. The Dojima and Nanako social links are, like, intense. <laughs> they are intense. They're, so, like, they're just, they're so sad all the time. It's crazy, bro. It's pretty late. Go hit the head. Night. Good night, Luna. <sighs> Alright. 
Yeah, it is raining. You must watch the Midnight Channel tonight. Ooh, something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. So today, there is nothing to do except eat an eye or mm, hang out with you. Uh, what am I at? Sun, 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 sun rank four. What is this? The guy at sun rank four. Okay, well. I'm going to trust in the guide and assume that we probably need the stat, the social stat points if it's prioritizing eating at Aya over um, doing this. I'm at rank 3 everything, which is pretty good going. So, but yeah, I mean, I don't really give a fuck about the music club anyway. <laughs> so yeah, we'll go eat at Aya. Like, I would... Uh, I would, I would do the music club, but like, if it's telling me to prioritize the stat points, I feel like I need the stat points, you know? Because there's a lot, there's actually a lot of stuff that's locked behind stat ranks, uh, especially now, so I feel like I definitely need to keep on top of it. So yeah, let's go. My job basically pays for me eating at fucking Aya every so often. <laughs> That's literally all the money goes to. Boom. Too bad, mister. Uh, yeah, yeah. Welcome back. It's supposed to rain tonight. Yeah, you would be correct. You would be correct. Let's see what happens. I'm excited. What are we gonna see? Something appear on TV. Let's take a look. Give me a cutscene or something. Come on. Figure of hair. It's obviously Rise. You look at the hair. She seems to be a girl. She's wearing a swimsuit. Oh, really? She looks somewhat like Rise Kujikawa, the I you saw on TV yesterday. Hello. Just keep zooming in on her chest and thighs. Hard to make out her face as a result. Game, you could have given me a cutscene. <laughs> You're right. Thought so. Oh, I guess I shouldn't be so excited. Yeah. There's a chance she might get kidnapped. Come on, we should go there tomorrow. Uh, what was it called again? Uh, oh yeah, Maruku Tofu. Dude, my heart's pounding already. We'll see you tomorrow. You're going to Maruku Tofu shop with Yosuke tomorrow. So I have to go to bed for tonight. I wanted a cutscene. <laughs> hey, did you hear? It looks like Rise Kujikawa really is here. You know the tofu store, Maruku? The owners of that place have the same last name, Kujikawa. Seriously? Hey, I practically live next door. I've been hearing that there's a big crowd at Maruku. I'm not surprised. But was it really her on yesterday's Midnight Channel? Didn't she seem a little... different? It was her, no doubt about it. Her curves, her posture, <laughs> and her beautiful slim legs. My man. What's that look for? Anyways, I'm positive, right? <laughs> uh, are we going? I don't really care about celebrities, but it's not like I got anything better to do. Sure, I'll tag along. Sorry, but me and Yukiko have plans. Give us a call if anything comes up. Plans. Okay. Sure. 
<laughs> well, shall we get going? But let's be clear on one thing. We're not spectators. We're on an investigation, got it? Yes, sir. Let's see. Let's see what happens. What's the dashi doing here? Huh? Uh, Mr. Detective, did something happen? Oh, it's you guys. Ay, ay, ay. These gawkers keep streaming in with their cars trying to park in the middle of the shopping district. Why is that? Don't you know? Risei Kuchikawa's here. Hey, did you see her already? Is she there? Which is it? Huh? We're asking why a plainclothes detective is here doing traffic control. <laughs> oh, uh, well, the Inaba Police Department isn't that big. We don't have enough staff. Well, I still have work to do, so I'll see you later. They just stuck a dodgy Dude, on it. You managed to scare off a police detective on active duty! I wasn't trying to scare the guy. I just said what I was thinking. But you're right. It's weird for the police to come out like this. Hey, you think the police suspect that Risa might be the next target, too? All right, clear out. Coming through. Hey, Adachi. Damn it, I told him not to leave his post. What are you guys doing? Hmm? Kanji Tatsumi. Are you friends with them? Like it's any of your business. If you say so. So I'll ask again. What are you all doing here? I can't see a reason. We're just passing by. Is that so? Oh, um... Well, who wouldn't want to come check it out if they found out an Idol's family ran an ordinary tofu store? I'm a, a big fan! Hmm. <laughs> Fine. But remember, she might be a celebrity, but this is her home. Try not to bother them too much. That cop's your uncle, huh? So, what the hell was that about? Are you guys under suspicion? Well, you they did say that. take us in once. But we can't just tell him everything, right? If we say anything about the other world, we only look more suspicious. They'll be watching us all the time. You got a point there. Ah, uh, man. There's no one in there but the old lady. Rosetta isn't here after all. I heard that she really is already here. But it might have just been a rumor. Well, it was fun while it lasted. Hey, people seem to be clearing off, which gives us chance. A rumor? What? She's not here? Seriously? <laughs> you sound like the world's about to end. Shut up! Anyways, now that all those people are gone, we might as well check inside. I'll buy something. Uh, recommend Silicon Norman Kanmudoki. It doesn't. I um. The guide says nothing about this, so. Oh, yeah, I can't eat tofu. So, just get some ganmodoki. Ganmodoki? Is that the kind with the rice cake in it? There's no rice cakes in them. They're sort of like fried tofu patties with veggies and stuff mixed in and... <laughs> oh, okay, I know what you mean. I think I can eat that. Let's see here. Sure enough, the only one here is your typical old lady. <sighs> Man, why don't you just ask if she's in back? Excuse me! Uh, yes, may I help you? What the... then, who's that? What? <laughs> <sighs> uh, are you Rise? Yeah, so? No way! Are you really reset? What do you want? Huh? Oh, sorry, um, uh, some tofu, please? Tofu? Which kind? Yo, yeah, oh, she, she kind of cute, though. <laughs> huh? w which one's which again? If you're going to eat it by itself, you should go with silken. Moment's better for cooking. Depends how you use it. Uh... Kanji, order something! <laughs> Why are you making me do it? You already picked Gamo a second ago. 
Dude here wants three Ganmodo key. Oh, I see. I'll go get them. She seems really sad. No. Wow. She's nothing like she seems on TV. I wonder if she's just tired. Man, but it's really her. I'm so glad I came. Mission complete. Wait, we haven't done what we came <laughs> here for yet. Um, uh, have you noticed anything weird lately? Weird? Like stalkers? Are you guys fans of mine? I wouldn't say we, but yeah. Dude here is a big fan. <laughs> you little... Why'd you let that slip? Her curves, her posture, even her beautiful slim legs. Oh my god. You finished god. checking them out yet or what? Oh my god. You're doing this on purpose, aren't you? I didn't say that. I never said any of that. Maybe you know already, but it's been dangerous in Inaba lately. And that's why we've been investigating some stuff. Oh yeah? Sorry, um, uh, let's see. Do you know about the TV show that comes on at midnight? I mean, it's not like regularly scheduled programming. How do I explain this? That thing that was on last night. The Midnight Channel, yeah? Oh, she knows. Oh, you know about it. Wait, what? You, you mean you saw it last night? I heard the rumors from some friends of mine. But that girl last night wasn't me. I've never been filmed wearing that swimsuit before. And the bust line. Huh? Mine aren't that big. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean now. I mean, what am I saying? Um, I'm sorry. Don't apologize so much. You're funny. Hey, she smiled. <laughs> what is that show about, anyway? Well, we're not too sure either. But you know there's been stuff happening here, right? We think the people who appear there are the ones who get kidnapped next. I know this is sudden, but we're not lying. Yeah, that's why we thought you should know about it. Huh, so that wasn't a dream. I was tired yesterday, but I couldn't sleep. And it was raining, so I decided to try that rumor I'd heard about. Hmm. All right, thanks. I'll be careful. Interesting. Here you go, three ganmo. That'll be 600 yen. There's extra tofu in there for everyone. A little thank you for worrying about me. Aww. Whoa, seriously? Thanks. Uh, Yosuke Senpai, you can't eat tofu, right? Want me to take yours? Hell no, I always eat what people give me. You can eat it for dinner. Nice. Later that day. Thank you very much. Your receipt's in the bag. Seems like the crowds are thinning out, so we'll be leaving now. If it gets rowdy again, just give us a call at the station. Okay. Uh, hang on a second. I'm sorry, but there's some things I'd like to ask you. He's gonna ask you. Do you know that there have been multiple violent cases around here lately? I thought he was gonna ask about us uh, uh, snooping around and like asking a question. Have you seen anyone suspicious around? Not really. It's been like always. Like always? Well, you're an idol, so I imagine you deal with folks like fans, paparazzi, and stalkers quite often. What made you take a break from showbiz? Does it really matter? Something's gone on there. I just needed a rest. And have you registered for school? I'm planning on going to Yasugami High. It was the closest. Well, I don't mean to alarm you, but... You do have some things in common with the recent victims. That's why, well... I might be kidnapped, right? I've been told that before. Don't worry, I'll be careful. Huh? Someone told you already? It was three guys. They were wearing uniforms, so I think they were high school no! students. No! She's right as out! Did one of them happen to look... How do I put it? Did he look something like a, a gang member? Wait! You think she's talking about your nephew and his friends? No, Rize. Mm -hmm. Fuck, we're gonna get, we're gonna get we're gonna get interrogated mm. when we get home. Something smells here. The recent disappearances between those and the two homicides. There's too many questions with no answers. To tell the truth, 
I followed my detective's intuition and came here to warn her. How could high school kids who know less than we do beat us to the punch? Were they just making up an excuse to talk to a famous celebrity? Yeah, we'll say that, we'll say that. Or... <laughs> Sir? My boy Dojima, no! Yasugami Hai. The second victim, Saki Konishi. And two other students who were missing for a while. I guess the investigation of the ones involved with the school hasn't turned up anything either. Are we gonna be in trouble if this keeps up? The prefectural police will be coming soon. They're the least of your worries. Keep your head in the game. Nah, that's getting good now. We sure have a lot of tofu. Yeah, it tastes great. He's gonna say. You visited Risei Kujikawa today. What did you talk about? Just gossip. I see. <sighs> Forget it. I shouldn't have brought it up. You guys met Risei chan? <sighs> yeah. Are you. Fighting again? The tension. <laughs> of course not. Here, hurry and finish your dinner. Mm. Man. <laughs> oh, I hate it. <laughs> it's raining tonight. Something appear on TV. Let's take a look. Still wearing the swimsuit. Yeah. This girl. It's Risei Kijikawa. The image is fairly clear tonight. Give me a cutscene. <laughs> Let's call Yosuke. Hey, we were right about it being Risei Kujikawa. The one on tonight seemed a lot creepier than the real Risei, but you could see her face clearly. There's no mistake. Let's all get together as soon as possible tomorrow. Would you like to save your progress? Bro, some shit's gonna go down now. That That's the... Uh, that's the indicator. So about the Midnight Channel last night, that had to be Risei Kujikawa. It even showed her face this time. So now we know one more thing. The ones that the culprit's targeting are... Broadcasted on TV. Exactly. So we can rule out the assumption that all the victims are connected to the incident with Ms. Yamano. As for Risei, I took a peek this morning and she was still at the shop. So I'm guessing that... TV show thing doesn't appear on the midnight channel until after the person enters the TV. Teddy said before that it might be the victim's own creation upon entering that world. I didn't understand at all at first, but now I feel it may be true. The one that appears on TV is your other self. Maybe the victim's true feelings are shown unconsciously. But we see them on the midnight channel before they disappear. You know, when it's still really fuzzy and you can't tell who it is. How do you explain that part? Yeah, it always happens before the person disappears. Like an advance notice. Or like a ransom note. But who are they announcing it to? And for what? I don't know. Ask the... Oops, I didn't mean to Is it possible that, that we see those images for the same reason? Huh? What do you mean? If the Midnight Channel shows the victim's true feelings, maybe it does the same for the culprit. Maybe what we're seeing is the culprit's intentions. Well, it's a possibility. The killer can throw people into the TV after all, which means they must have the same power that we do. So, when the killer thinks, I'm gonna attack someone now, that's what we see on TV? I don't know about that. Well, if we're gonna go that far with it, we might as well say that's the basis for that entire world. Like it's some kind of mix of the minds of the victims and the killer. 
Or maybe it's everyone's minds. Some deep shit. Always, nothing makes sense. Hey, Kanji kun, you still with us? You haven't said a word yet. <laughs> no, well, uh, um, well, uh, you weren't sleeping, were you? Uh, of course not. I was, uh, <clears throat> lost in thought. All alone. <sighs> I wish I knew what that world's all about. Teddy's explanations have so many maybes in them that I don't understand the first thing about it. Why would the culprits throw people inside the TV in the first place? They must know by now that people die when they're in there long enough. There's no doubt it's attempted murder. So the TV's a good way to do that because the police can never prove anything about the crime. Murder, huh? So the killer's got a grudge against certain people? Well, I know there's a shitload of people who've got my number. How about you, Yukiko-senpai? Anyone hate you so bad they'd get rid of you forever? No. <laughs> nope. Uh, Yukiko? There's always a slight chance, and you just don't realize it. <laughs> but if we're trying to think of a common grudge someone would have against all the victims, well, I'm drawing a blank. Well, the good thing is, we have another shot at getting ahead of the killer. We can leave the motive aside for now. Once we catch him, we'll make him talk. The only thing we can be sure of now is that Risei is in danger. Wait, we get to do another stakeout? Oh, no. Hell yeah! This time we'll catch him in the act. We gotta go with donuts and milk. You said it. There's no better meal than that for a man on a stakeout. Oh, huh? and throw in some disposable diapers. For what? They don't even sell those here. We have them at Juness. Oh, too much information. <laughs> what? You guys finished yet? Let's hurry up and get going. <laughs> huh? What brings you here? Oh, uh, well, I'm doing legwork. Uh, what did I do to deserve babysitting detail? Yo, Dojima's put him up to it. He's oh my god, Dojima, you fucker. He's put a dachi up to fucking following us around. I mean, it's nothing major. It's not like Dojima-san ordered me here. Shaking my head, guys. So, what are you kids up to? Buying snacks? We were just about to head over to the tofu shop to see Risei-chan. Oh, I see. Hey, I'm on my way there too. Oh, then why don't we go there together? Come on, he's a detective on active duty. Not a bad guy to have around. <laughs> yeah, but it's also a dachi. <laughs> Reese is tending to the shop. Don't stop. The culprit might get suspicious. But well, we walked past her like a thousand times already. <laughs> Come on out, you bastard. We're ready for you. <gasps> Look! Uh, who's there? What the fuck? What? Hey, he's running away. Get back here. Nah, he had like he had like a, a camera. Stop running, damn it. He's probably just like a a, a mega fan of Rize or something like that. Yeah, look at this dude with a purple backpack. That nah, yeah. Don't, don't come near me. Shut up. What kind of idiot would listen to I'll do it, you know. What are you gonna do if I get run over? Huh? What? No! If the suspect gets injured, the police will be held responsible. They'll get really angry and. Uh... 
I'll do it, I swear. S -s Get out of here and stop chasing me. Hey, what should we do? Tackle him from behind. I mean, you can't get behind him. But... How? Yeah. Come on. All right. On my mark. Look over there, a Martian. <laughs> oh! Seriously. <laughs> How dare you assault an ordinary citizen? Shut the hell up, murderer. We're taking your punk ass in. What? Time out! What do you mean, murderer? It's no use playing dumb. Wait a second. I just really like Rosette. So yeah. I wanted to take a peek at her room. It's just a perv. <laughs> Look, see? All I've got on me is a bunch of cameras. Yep, you're the culprit, all right. No two ways about it. All right, I'll take it from here. We'll hear your story down at the station. <laughs> I've waited to use that line. Oh my god. Please, let me go! I didn't do anything wrong! I know for a fact it's not a crime in this country to take secret pictures! But is it not? Hey, don't you understand what's happening here? You're under suspicion of murder. Come with me. We'll talk about this later. Wow, that went better than I thought. What a coup. I gotta thank you guys for all your help. Well done. Oh, sure! But you really should stop getting involved with this stuff. It's dangerous. I know Dojima-san was worried sick. Come on, let's go. <sighs> Imagine. Is it really over? No. <laughs> Rest is up to the cops. Looks like the killer was a pervert, just like we thought. Wait, does that mean the case is closed? Seriously? I think not, my friends. Hey, we should let Risa know the good news. Oh, hello. Would you like some tofu? Oh, uh, hello. Um. Oh, did you come to see Risa? She seems to have gone out, unfortunately. Huh? But wasn't she just here? She does that sometimes. She'll just wander out without a word. Uh... You must forgive her. She's quite worn out in many ways. She left without saying anything? Come on, you worry too much. She must have just stepped out. I mean, we caught the guy. 